is a continuation of the single greatest witch hunt of all time. The banks got back their money. Again, there was never a default. There was never a problem. Everything was perfect. There was no crime. The crime is against me because we have a corrupt district attorney, but we have a corrupt attorney general. And it all comes down from the DOJ that totally coordinated this in Washington because I'm leading, I'm the leading candidate, I'm leading Biden by 10 points, and I'm leading the Republicans by 50 and 60 points. That's pretty much, they say, over. I never accept that, but they say it's over. And now I have to go before a rogue judge as a continuation of Russia, 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 as a continuation of the greatest witch hunt of all time, and I don't think the people of this country are going to stand for it. If I weren't leading in all the polls, or if I weren't running, I wouldn't have any of these cases. I wouldn't be seeing you this morning. But I'll be seeing a lot of you, because this is a horrible thing that's happening to our country, and we've got to get it straightened away. So we'll go in and see our rogue judge, and we'll listen to this man. And uh, I think most people get it. People are getting it. I can tell you the voters getting it because every time they give me a fake indictment, I go up in the polls and that's never happened before. But this is a disgrace. And you're going to go after this attorney general because she's turning off everybody from coming in. You know, I don't know if you should take a look at the outflow of business. Businesses are fleeing New York because of horrible, horrible attorney generals and judges like we have. They go to other places where they can be treated fairly and with respect. Thank you very much, everybody. Thank you. Thank you.